front or back of my head. I got condos in that bitch head. <laughs> Hey y'all, so I made it back home and I went and I just picked up my rug that delivered today for my living room and y'all, I literally redid my living room like for like three different times. Like I've bought things, returned things. I'm just such an indecisive person and I just don't know how I want my living room to be. I don't know like the vibe that I'm going for. It's like I did, but then I see other stuff and I'm like, ugh, I want it like that. Then I order and I be like, that don't look right. So then I return it and it's just been like months of that. So my living room literally looks like this right now. So I know, let me let it focus. Everything that I have in there right now I'm for sure gonna have it stay like that. These two were on the wall right there and I had a picture in the middle, but then I was gonna do silver and gold together, but then I decided I didn't wanna do the gold anymore. So now I'm not gonna keep those. I took the picture that was up, down, put it in my room. I had a, three different rugs under here. I had three different rugs. I then moved that and I put that in my room, but then I'm like, uh, I kinda like that, so. I put that back. I decided that's going to stay. I'm always moving these ottomans around because I don't know if I want anything underneath the TV or if I want to put ottomans like by the couch. I don't know. I ordered some more decorative pillows and some stuff that go on my coffee table to give it a pop of color. But the rug came in today. And I hope I like it, cause it don't really look like the picture. It don't really look like the picture online. And if it's not, I'm gonna be so sad. Cause this is why my living room isn't finished. I really hope I like this. Hmm. I'm not gonna cut it too much just in case. The silver, metallic, the creams. Bro, bro, bro. What? Do y'all see that? I don't think y'all see it. I don't think y'all see it, bro. Okay. Now, I'm gonna figure out. I'm in love. Wow, that looks so nice. This pillow's not staying. This came with the couch, but I just used it to lay on. But, wow, I'm in love. Like, I am in love. What? Look at the fucking, look at the fucking details. No, nah, that looks great. That looks great. Good morning, y'all. It is the next day. 
What time is it? It's 8 o'clock in the morning. I was really up since 7. But I have work today. I got over work on a music video all day today. And I got some clients after. So I'm trying to eat this yogurt. Because I know after I do hair, we're going to have some free time. So I'm going to get food after. But I don't have enough time to get food now. So. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to let my dog eat. He fucking that shit up. Eat. Yeah, I'm trying to let my dog eat so I can go. But today is a great morning. I hope today's going to be a good day. It will be a good day. So I'm going to try to vlog like here and there when I'm working. But you know, like it's a music video and I don't want to <laughs> show too much. But I'm going to get like a couple behind the scene clips. Like of us in the spring or us like, you know, just doing different things. But I'm going to go ahead and head out. Talk to y'all when I get back. What's up, y'all? Today is Saturday. I don't work today. I'm off today. I'm off actually the whole weekend. So I'm too excited about that because I've been working a lot lately. So I'm on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. I'm trying to like, I'm vlogging in my car. This is my first time vlogging in the car in like forever. Forever, but I'm on my way to the nail salon right now to go get my nails done. You see my nails right now. Um, I hate them. I literally hated them the second I got them done. Like I was in a nail salon telling the lady like what she needed to fix like every every minute. Like she just did a horrible job. I tried to, I sh I went back to the nail salon to get it fixed the next day because like my nail was chipping and stuff like that. But then I was going out of town like that night and it just didn't work out. So I just ended up not even getting my nails fixed. So I got these done like two weeks ago. But I'm about to get my nails done today because I'm too excited about that. Um, it's 12 o'clock. My appointment was at 12 o'clock. It's my ETA is 1236. And it's not far away from me at all. Why am I late? I don't know. I don't know. I didn't even work out this morning. I was supposed to go to the gym. I didn't work out this morning. But I just I was just tired from yesterday. Like I was working. I started working at 8 a.m. yesterday. I told you guys I worked on set. I didn't. I don't know. I didn't. I don't think I vlogged that out for real, for real. But then I went and did some clients after that at 6 p.m. And I got home and I just did my homegirl hair. I just did a lot. You know, I was just doing a lot yesterday. So that didn't go as planned. I'm going to finish driving and get to where I need to go because I'm already late. laughing and nothing is funny I'm laughing because I look a mess actually but I've been sitting on my couch for like an hour and a half just editing rooms and posting my tiktok so this is the hair roll that I edited oh I'm not gonna be able to play the music That's the hair roll then I did a nail oh it's on my other phone I did a nail roll for my personal page What? Okay, here was mine. Get on their phone like, clickety clack, the bad bitch is back. <laughs> Girls get their nails done and get on their phone like, clickety clack, the bad bitch is back. <laughs> okay, so that was the, hold on. That was the nail one and then I did a TikTok one. So, I was doing that. That literally took like an hour and a half to do those three videos. And I still have to edit this YouTube video that I have yet to upload. But I got bored after doing all those videos. And then I ordered me some crumble cookie for the first time. 
because I seen somebody post it, but now I just seen their update and they said it was terrible. So now I'm scared because I just spent $25 on those four cookies because I didn't feel like going to go get pick them up. Like it was a 27 minute drive. I'm not making that drive. Like I'm not, I'm just not, but <sighs> they just said the cookies were nasty. Yeah, this leaf out stuff, it's for the birds. Like, I love leaf outs. I love how natural they make me look. But just like, I literally flat iron my leaf out this morning. I flat iron my leaf out this morning. And it's puffy all over again. Like, it's, it's puffy. It's not giving sleek. You see that? It's not giving sleek, so I'm about to put a front on back on my head. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, I was on the phone, but. So my cookies are here and I don't even know what flavor I got. I'm recording on my camera and I'm doing a TikTok. So um, yeah, y'all bear with me. So y'all, I got some crumble cookie for the first time. I door dashed or ordered it online and had it delivered. And I got a four box and spent like $27. So I hope these cookies are good. Um, let me tell y'all the flavors that I got real quick, real quick. Okay, so I got the milk chocolate chip, the caramel apple, a blue mint, but I think the blue mint is also cookies and cream, cookies and cream, a blue mint, but I think the blue mint is also cookies and cream, and then the classic pink sugar, so this is how they look. I'm gonna try the cookies and cream, or no, I'm gonna try the pink sugar cookie first. It's not terrible, I just don't think I like the icing on it. I think the icing on it is not it, but. The actual cookie part is straight. It's okay. Yeah, that blue may go crazy. This one's straight. Okay, this one is chocolate chip. It's okay. This is like a chocolate chip cookie. It might be better if I heat it up though. I'm scared about this one. It's like I like caramel, but this can go wrong real quick. Oh, this one actually good. Yeah, this one in the blue mint. This one might be the best one. I think it's because I'm a dancer. Hey y'all, it is Sunday. So I ain't never had nobody, <laughs> I ain't never had nobody cook for me for, before like full blown meal, like just took over the kitchen and just cooking me a whole di a whole meal. So I'm excited. Like I get to just sit back and let the food be cooked. But we're supposed to be going to the fair today where's the fair at though she's doing motorsport what is that i don't know where that is. we're supposed to be going to the fair today georgia state oh okay okay georgia state so we got some we cooking some sausage eggs or she's cooking some sausage eggs we're doing some breakfast potatoes grits and then we have some cinnamon rolls but we're gonna put these in a waffle maker 
be doing some mimosas, mimosas and then later on it's actually cooking a seafood boil um for us to eat when we come back from the fair I worked out this morning and I just had a protein shake. I didn't even eat breakfast because I literally was saving my appetite for sassy. Oh, not the cream cheese. What you know about the cream cheese? What? I, that's what that's that's what I was really waiting to see. Like, I, okay, what you know about that cream cheese, girl? I know that, but you know, everybody don't know about the cream cheese. But yeah, y'all, it's a nice Sunday. We got the vibes going. I had music playing, but you know, I can't play my music because of us recording. But we literally have the vibes going right now. So y'all, we just changed clothes. We are about to go to the fair now. They already hurry up and rush because we supposed to be meeting some people, but this is what I have on. Bye. Oh, I'm coming, don't worry. This is what I have on, some sweatpants, someone's, and yeah, just something real comfortable. Come back over here, just something real comfortable. But I'm not gonna bring my camera because I don't wanna have my camera in the fair, of course, and I don't have my camera on me or in the car. I don't want anybody to take it. So I'm gonna leave my camera here, but I will vlog on my phone. So catch y'all at the fair. Y'all, while we missed the exit, Sassy Ass is backing up on this motherfucking exit. <laughs> I always do these. Like, I'm, like, not, I'm not going around. I'm not going around. I'm the two tomorrow. <laughs> Cardi, Burst, got us. <laughs> you know, like. What the fuck? Lost track of everything. I got the recording. And I got my mimosa, like, yeah. I had to take the shit out of the house because it was so good, like, I did it. <laughs> yeah. <Woo! laughs> we on the next ride, the swing. Sassy said this was about to ride. Yeah, I think so. I ain't had that coming in. I got condos in that bitch head. What Cardi said? What Cardi said? I don't feel no bitch say. What else you said? I got condos in that I got condos in that bitch head. Fire. Book clips at the fair. On the rides. I was really risking it too because I was all up in the air recording. But Sassy's cooking for me again. She's making some seafood. I think I'm gonna make the, well I know I am. I'm making the bee love sauce to go with the seafood. So I used to make it all the time at my mom's house. But So y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all a story time about what happened at the fair today. I was trying to record while it was happening, but the lighting was off. It was just so much going on. So we go to get some tickets. We already paid the park, paid to get in, then paid for some, you know, we got to get on tickets to get in ride, on the rides and stuff. So we go to a stand, and it's a white man at the stand, an older white man, and we down south. And we like, um, we want to get some tickets. Like, what's the best option? So he like telling my homegirl Sassy, like, you know, you can buy this option with the twenty dollars for twenty tickets, or it was twenty dollars for twenty five tickets, or you can get this fifty dollars for fifty six tickets. So we're like, okay. He like, but this $50 one for 56 tickets is the best option. So we like, mm, okay. Then we go back to who we met up with and they like, where y'all stamp? We like, what you mean, where's our stamp? They're like, why Why do y'all didn't get a stamp so y'all can get unlimited rides? So we like, what? He ain't saying nothing. We, we don't know nothing about that. So I'm like, oh no, it's high. let's go. Let's go back and get our money so we can get the stamp instead or, or pay more so we can get a stamp instead because we not gonna just, why would you tell us that we can, <laughs> Get a stamp for thirty dollars, and we could ride unlimited rides. And he just meant to spend fifty dollars for fifty-six tickets. Like, you really didn't want to tell us that, so we can pay more. So we're like, nah. So I go back over there, and we like, can we exchange this or can we get a stamp? He looked at the sign. He said, no refunds. I'm like, what? Why you didn't say that beforehand that we could have just got a stamp for unlimited rides? Like, why you didn't just say that beforehand? So we like, forget it, forget it. So I'm like, nah. Let's just such like, such like, forget it. So I'm like, let's just go up front. Like she like, we'll just go up front and um. Talk to security guard or something like that. Or somebody at the stamp ticket or at the stamp line so we can like persuade them to 
get these tickets and give us a stamp she was like yeah it's actually gonna say in the middle of like of us, of us walking she like and yeah like his ass has said some racist shit to me just down the third like when we when we was even getting the tickets i'm like what when when did he say something racist to you she was like yeah because we when we first got to that window he was on his phone he wasn't paying us any attention then Sassy tapped on the window. She was like, hello. Then he looked up and then he realized we was trying to buy something. He was like, oh, you don't tap on a window, especially to a white man. <laughs> I swear to God, y'all, I did not hear to him. I did not hear him say that to Sassy and I'm standing right next to her. Like I did not hear that at all. So I'm like, you just now saying this? Sassy like, he said it. I thought you would have heard it. I'm like, I did not hear that. Like, I did not hear that man say that to her. If I would have heard that, like, it would have went way differently. I'm like, he really said that? So I'm like, come on, let's go tell them up front because that helped our case even more. So we ended up going to, like, the office and telling the office, like, what the fuck that man had said to us because ain't no way y'all sitting here running this damn fair and y'all got folks talking to people any kind of way like that. Talking about you don't tap on no window, especially not to no white man. Nigga, we in 2022. Who the fuck are you talking to like that? And why are you talking to us like that over some tickets or over us tapping the window because you're not paying attention because you